reached Jeff Hall. I'm out of the office. The crew and I are out testing a couple boats at the islands. We'll be back in the shop tomorrow. I don't really know when I'm off work and on work, like, to be honest. Because like, well, I'll come home and I'll research something, and it's for work. That's that's me. I don't feel like we're working when we're doing this stuff, because it's so much a part of who I am and and what I want to do. And we're we're lucky to be able to do that. really young I always had like a crazy ADD that would basically just drive this desire to build things and create things and once I became introduced to fiberglass and resins and epoxies and that's just opened this world of things that you could build. And Pete Worcester, he owns a snowboard factory, and I was able to work with him building snowboards for a season, and that just blew my mind. Having that knowledge from the snowboard stuff kind of propelled me into building surfboards. I never thought of boats being something that would replace surfboards. I always just thought of it as another avenue of how to use fiberglass and build things. When we built surfboards, they were toys. Building boats, they're toys. That's what drives the excitement of it. That's what, when you smell the fiberglass, you smell the resin, and you see it kick off, you know that you're one step closer to that goal of that boat hitting the water. What really excites me about building boats here is that we have a unique waterway, Santa Barbara Channel. I think the freedom of being out on the ocean on a boat is to be able to get away. When you go out to the islands, you could be out there and see nobody and just be in nature. Being a part of the community that has these boats, there, there's so many variables of what you can do. You can be fishing, you could be diving, you could be hiking, you could just be exploring. You feel like you're going to Jurassic Park. This season in life, this time in life, I'm realizing that having the time to be on the water is way more valuable than growing the company. We live in a world where everybody's just trying to crush it and make the most money they can and maximize everything. At the end of the day, I want to have more time to be on the water, more time with the family, more time with good friends, and to continue building boats. And those boats are my vacations. That's what I'm trying to shape the next 20 years to look like.